Welcome back, everyone, to Pontos Fathom Hobbies. This is Season 7, Episode 5 of Game of Thrones, and we are playing with the Mother of Dragons expansion. Um, we're calling this episode our Clash of Kings uh, series. So we just had a great round four. Uh, you can uh, see that we've placed there's a number of victories here. Uh, Targaryens have now got fully inva full invasion into Dragonstone. They've moved into the Kingswood. We've had skirmishes between the Starks and the Greyjoys. Skirmishes between the uh, Lannisters and the Greyjoys, as well as um, the Baratheons and uh, the uh, House Aaron. And we've also got movement down below from Sunspear and High Garden. So looking forward to jumping into round number five. We've got the token here. Our dragon strength is up to two at this point. So I'm going to go ahead and um, progress the Iron Bank. So far, only the great the, um, the Targaryens have been profiting from the Iron Bank because they have this minus one token on Bravos, and that basically means when they get the third place here, they can they can basically um, take a loan for free uh, by controlling the bank. Uh, so let's jump into round number five. Before we do, quick shout out to our channel sponsor, Pontos Fathom Press. Necromancy of Nyarlathotep, Genealogy of Cthulhu. Check out our book link, uh, bookstore link below. Um, you can also check out our Patreon. And as usual, liking, subscribing helps us to grow the channel. So let's jump right into it. Um, I'll go ahead and turn over our Westeros phase cards. And we'll see what we get. First card up is... Supply. Adjust the supply track. Reconcile armies. Okay, so let's kind of go through this. We'll start out with the... A token underneath the board here. Greyjoy token there. So the board was popped up. Okay, so we'll start out with... I'll just go in order. So we'll just start out with House Tyr Tyrell. Uh, Tyrell has got in... 3-2-2. Three, two, two. So they got 2-2. Two, two. They should be fine. They've got one, two, th one, two, three, four, five. They're actually up to five supply now. So they can do that. Uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, sorry, four. They are at four. Uh, let's go to Targaryen. Targaryen has got one, two, three, four. Five, six. Targaryens are at six now. They can have four, three, two, two, two. So they got four, three. So we're going to have to migrate one of these guys out. Two, two. We're going to switch this out this way. We're going to reconcile it that way. Okay. Uh, so we got four, three, two, two. And we can do another two. Uh, so that's fine. We'll go to Aaron. They've got one, two barrels. They're still at two. They can do three and two. Uh, so they're going to lose one of these guys here. So that's going to reconcile for them. We'll go to Lannister. They've got two, three. So they can do three. Lannister is now on three. One, two, three. Oh, they only have three now. So they're also going to. So they've got to move down to three. They have three, two, two. They're fine. Um, that's next up is Greyjoy. They've got one, two. So they can do, um, they're going to move back, back down to two. They have three and a two. They're fine. Uh, we'll have to move these out like this. Two and two. Three and two. So like that. Can migrate this one here, I suppose. Three and two. 
Uh, next one is uh, Baratheon. Baratheon has got. Whoa, 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 whoa. Baratheon has zero. Oh no, this is not good for Baratheon. So they get two and two. So they're going to have to lose. We'll have to move one of their ships out. We'll have to move one of these out, one of these. So they've got two and two. So they have, that's their, their, they've lost basically supply chain. So people kind of go back into the, to the woodworks, we'll kind of see it as that. Uh, next is, there's a brutal, the supply chain round. Uh, Martel, they've got uh, one, two, three. So they've got three, one, two, three. Uh, Martel has got three. Still at so they're moved up to three. They get three, two, and two. Three, two, and two, and two. They can do an extra two, but they're okay for now. Uh, next up is Stark. Final Stark is one, two, three. Stark moves to three. Actually, Stark moves to one, two, not three. One, two, so they get three, two, and two, and they're good. Okay, so that's uh, that's going to do it for supply. Next up is Clash of Kings. We'll bid on the influence track. I'm just going to roll it out. One, two, three, we'll put Baratheon back at the top. Slide everybody down. And then we'll put uh, Baratheon back at the top here, too. And then lastly, uh, that's going to be Targaryen. Cannot be Targaryen. So we'll roll it again. And we'll make it Aaron. Sorry, we'll make it um, Lan Lannister. Lannisters get the crow. Okay, so we bid on the track. Uh, Web of Lies. We're going to move the Wilding token up one. Supply orders cannot be played during this phase. And then finally, oh, sorry, that was already that one. This is this one, Web of Lies. The holder of the Valerian Steel Blade, which has now gone to Baratheon. Defense orders cannot be played. Defense orders cannot be played. Sure, we cannot play defense orders. That sounds fine. Uh, and then the long plan, Targaryen player may discard one power token, sure, to player places a to to a one loyalty ta token in two different land areas, Castle Black and Ironwood. So we can move to Castle Black. Castle Black already has one in Ironwood. Ironwood does not have one, so we'll move to there. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, jump into the... March orders. So we're going to go ahead and give these out. Uh, we're going to give the Targaryens. Uh, we're going to give them. Gonna give them this and this. We'll also give a. This. We'll also give a. This. A this. And let's see what else we've got here. That's it. Oh, we got that one there too. Oh, why not? We'll just put this here for them. Okay, so Targaryen orders placed. We'll do Lannister next. Lannister. Let's have them go into now. We have Lannisters go here. Oops. Oops. And we'll have Lannisters go here. And we'll have Lannisters go here. 
and Lannisters go here. Okay, so Lannisters placed. Uh, let's go ahead with uh, Aaron. And then we'll go ahead with Greyjoy. Greyjoy, the ability to Greyjoy is going to take this one here. They'll take this one um, here. They'll take this one here. And they'll take Okay, Greyjoys are placed. Let's do Baratheons next. Oh, that's not a Baratheon piece. Here. Okay, Baratheons are sort of pretty weak at this point. Uh, we'll go over to Stark. Actually, uh, Sunspear. Let's give them... Uh, Okay, Sunspear placed, and finally Stark. Stark will get uh, Oh, Greyjoy's got one here. Come in here. Stark will do a in here. Okay, that's going to do it. Let's do our reveal orders. Uh, we're flipping Red Wine Straits, uh, Red Wine Straits, Dornish Marches, uh, the Golden Sound, Sunset Sea, Flints, Grey Watch, Winterfell. The Shivering Sea, the Narrow Sea, Mountains of the Moon, Heron Hall, Lannisport, Blackwater, and over on Essos, we will go to Pentos, Bravos. Norvos and the Rhone. Okay, so we got that. Uh, let's go ahead and start with our raid orders. First up for the raid orders, um, checking across, we've got a raid order to uh, Targaryen versus Stark. One raid order done. Next up, we've got a raid order for. Um, Red Wine Straits from Tyrell to Greyjoy. We've got a 
Lannisport to Golden Sound. We've got a That's going to do it for the raid orders. Let's go in our march orders now, starting with the Baratheons. Uh, they will take a shot at the Mountains of the Moon with a plus one. So they got four plus one is five. They've got five, but it's going to come down to the cards. So let's see what we get here. So Davos Seaworth and Godric Borel. Uh, that's going to be a retreat with a... You gain one and a sword icon, so they're going to lose one of their, um, one of their uh, people, and they'll have to retreat into the Erie. And we've moved into Cracklecaw Point, so Baratheons can leave a thing behind here. Take these tokens out. Uh, let's go next into. Um, Lannister. Lannister will attack Greyjoy. Actually, they raided this, so that will be... Take that out. So, Lannisters versus Greyjoy. Lannisters. Uh, get a card out for each. It's uh, 5, 6, 7 versus 3... And then it's v Vitarian Greyjoy versus Sir K Gregor Clegane with three swords. Clegane wins it. This piece is taken off the map. We've moved from River Run and we've overtaken Seaguard from the Greyjoys. Greyjoys have losses. And the Clegane beats v Vitarian uh, Greyjoy. So that's that. That's a big defeat for the Greyjoys here and a, an awesome victory for um, Lannisters. Pull that off as well. I will throw behind a Lannister token on River Run. Next up, uh, we've got after Lannisters, we've got Sunspear. Sunspear will go ahead and attack uh, the Baratheons from the Boneway into Storm's End. So Baratheons have four. Dorne has five. Let's see what we get for the cards. Arian Martell versus Brienne of Tarth. It's going to be four, five, six versus four, six. If we have this. If you're defending this, they return to the area. Uh, plus, so it's going to be a, yeah, so I think it's going to be Storm's End is going to retreat. We're going to have to, oh, actually, we have to retreat back because it's, a, it's, a, it's basically a draw. So we'll go with that. Uh, we'll clear these out as well. Okay, that was uh, Sun Spear. Martell, sorry. Martell Stark. Stark will attack the. Um, Stark will attack the Greyjoys in the fingers. Starks attack Greyjoys in the fingers. We'll get a Stark card out. We'll get a Greyjoy card out. Let's see what we get here. Dagmar Clefthaw and Sir Roderick Castle. It's three, five, six, seven, eight versus five, six. Uh, Greyjoys have to retreat. I guess they will retreat to the twins. I don't know where they can retreat to. They cannot retreat. So what's the rule, guys, if they cannot retreat? Um, it says retreat... Oh, all units must be destroyed if there is no retreat. So, 
Greyjoy army gets destroyed at the fingers. Wow, that is fantastic. That's crazy. At the hands of Sir Roderick Castle. Sir Roderick Castle has a slaughter of Greyjoys um, in the fingers. Interesting. Um, okay, so next up is Greyjoy. Greyjoy's not doing well this round. Let's see if they can get a defeat against the... Um, I was going to have the Greyjoys go and attack uh, south across the boats, but I think they're going to counterattack with the Starks. So Starks have minus one here. So it's one versus two. We'll get a Stark card and a Greyjoy card, and we'll see what this comes up as. We've got Umber. The Umber Berserkers. Versus Arion Damfair. So it's going to be plus two for the Umbers. So they have two. Minus one is one. Three versus two. Three versus two. Greyjoys retreat. And Umber destroys one of the Greyjoy units. The Ironborn are not doing well this round. This is a rough round for the Greyjoys. Let's go ahead and continue with House Tyrrell. Uh, they are going to go ahead, and I'm going to have them move into uh, the Sea Road Marches. Sea Road Marches, they'll just do a march. And we're back to Aaron. Uh, basically, they'll just, I guess just because they have that march, they can attack into the um, C. Now this was here. I don't need this piece. Uh, it's one versus one, but it'll depend on their cards. So let's see what they've got here. Eddard Stark versus Robert Aaron. Wow, that's no comp compromise at all. Eddard Stark on the ship with two swords. They are defeated. Uh, from the combat there. Finally, Targaryen. Uh, first up, Targaryen will... Let's have them go and attack the Blackwater Bay. It's three versus one. We'll give them a card. Baratheon is down to a mercenary card. Baratheons have... Genos Slint and the Targaryens have Dario uh, Dario Naharis. So three and two, three versus six. They're going to retreat out to here. Uh, Dario Naharis kills, so this is taken off the board. So uh, again, another uh, victory for them, Targaryens. Um, hey guys, leave a comment. Can we leave a token in a sea space or only on a land space? Can we own a, a sea space? I don't know about that. Okay, let's go next to, I guess it's Targaryen again. Uh, we'll have the Greyjoy. Let's have Greyjoy. They're going to move from this fleet. One, two. This is actually here. Three, four. Um, they're going to come to High Garden because they're able to do that, so let's just take that out. Greyjoy. Uh, next up is, uh, we'll get the Targaryens trying to get, we've got Dragon Strength at two. Let's send dragons into the Blackwater against the, I believe this is already taken. Take, we'll send the dragons into the Blackwater with four. It'll be four versus four, plus our cards. We do have a minus one, so it's three versus four. Let's see what they get for their card. They get Marjorie Tyrrell. Marjorie Tyrrell versus Ariston Whitebeard. So it's three and three is six, four and one is five. 
uh, they actually have a sword, so they can retreat one, but they will lose a unit. And Targaryens will gain a Targaryen symbol, which can move them, advance them one more in the, in the victory point. So I'll just put it here. Okay, and one more Targaryen play. Uh, I think they will go ahead and just claim by flying this dragon out. And I'll actually leave Targaryen symbols here in this land so they can get, get consolidation tokens and whatever. They own the Rhone and the Narvas. Um, I'm going to take this last dragon. Here's a Targaryen dragon, if you guys have not seen one. And I'm going to fly it down to the arbor. There's nobody here. And they will gain a second token. And that will move them to five victory points. And that's about going to wrap it up for the round. Uh, anything else outstanding here? Uh, this token is done. No, so that's going to do it. Oh, we do have consolidate tokens. I will grab some tokens for the players. Um, so we get one for Targaryen. We get one for Aaron. We get one for Sunspear. And we will see you guys in round number six. I'll move the counter over and, and talk to you then. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.